Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today I want to talk about an error that has been causing a lot of frustration for gamers. Inzoi, insufficient video memory to run the game. This error basically means that the game is trying to use more graphics memory than your system currently has available, which can be due to a number of reasons. It might be that you're running on integrated graphics instead of a dedicated GPU, your drivers are out of date, or there might be some system settings causing conflicts. Essentially, the game expects a certain level of performance and VRAM to run smoothly, and when it doesn't get that, it throws this error. One of the most common fixes is to upgrade to a dedicated graphics card. Many players have found that integrated graphics just don't cut it for modern games, and moving to a card that offers sufficient VRAM something around the level of an RTX 2060 or better, can immediately resolve the issue. But if you already have a dedicated GPU, the next step is to ensure your drivers are fully up to date. Outdated drivers can cause your system to misreport available video memory or fail to optimize how it uses that memory. Head over to your GPU manufacturer's website, download the latest drivers, and give it another try. Some users have also had success by updating their motherboard's BIOS, particularly if you're using one of the newer Intel processors. A BIOS update can sometimes help your system better recognize and manage your GPU, leading to improved video memory allocation. Another potential tweak involves your GPU power settings. If you've been overclocking or fiddling with the power usage settings for extra performance, resetting these settings back to their defaults might help the GPU operate within its optimal range and avoid memory issues. It's also really important to double check your overall system specifications. Using tools like the system information feature on platforms such as Steam can help you see exactly what resources your computer is working with. This way, you can confirm if you're actually meeting the game's minimum requirements for things like VRAM, RAM, and CPU power. And if your system still falls short, consider cloud gaming services like GeForce Now. These services allow you to stream games from powerful remote servers, bypassing the limitations of your own hardware until you're ready for an upgrade. I hope this video helps clear up what the error means and gives you some solid steps to fix it. If you've had similar issues or found another solution that worked for you, drop a comment below. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more gaming tips and troubleshooting guides. Thanks for watching, and happy gaming.